Hi everyone, Release Fire here. So I'm gonna talk you through how to get the Nightmare Key in level four, Angler's Tunnel. It's a bit of another tricky one, so hopefully it's easy enough to follow. But you can always leave me a comment below if you're struggling to get to anywhere in the video. Equally, drop me a like if the video helps you out. But essentially what you're aiming for is the very north of the map once you get through to the central section. So you can see that on the map here, it's right at the very top. So not where Link is at the moment, right at the very top. You can see the two blocks. It's the one just below that is where you'll find this room where I'm at at the moment. And what you want to do is press on each of the tiles in the right order, which you can see me doing now. However, you can only do that once you can swim in the deeper water. So you'll need to have the flippers to do that. If you haven't got the flippers as of yet, you can check that out in the video above. But once you've got the flippers, you can do it in exactly that order and all the lights will come on and a set of stairs will open up. Head down the stairs and you'll find yourself in this room. And then you just need to get past the thwomps or thwomp lookalikes, get close to them and they will drop. I love their boggly eyes when they follow Link, it's amazing. It's easy to get distracted. But this last one is more difficult, so you need to step up here and jump onto it. So you need to tease it down a little bit, so you need to stand close enough to get it down and then as soon as it's down, you need to jump up and jump on its head, ride it to the top, jump on across and then jump up here and that will get you into this area and this is where you'll find the nightmare key. So as soon as you open the chest, there it is. So that's everything that you need to know about how to get the nightmare key in level four Angler's Tunnel. Hopefully the video helps you out. If you don't know where any of the small keys are to get through to any of the sections that I've covered, you can check those out in the video linked above. But like I said, hopefully the video helps you out. If it does, drop me a like below. You can also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already with the links on the left hand side and hit that bell button if you wanna get notifications for all of my videos as they come out. You can check out the rest of my series with the links on the right hand side. Leave any comments below. Let me know how you're getting on in The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening and I will catch you next time.